Still you can't be fed up Go girls with the left and the right Go green like the what is going on guys, Son of Beast here. This is game two of the NBA playoffs of Raptors versus the Bucks. After with a close win that the Bucks made a win for, could have tried to make the win, but unfortunately the Raptors gave it out in the first game that was being recently off the, uh, off the peg to make it really clear and make some clear blocks right from the other team. But for Giannis, he has to do something about with the, uh, with the offensive group by each possession. Now the game two is now on the board. Let's find out what happens now and see what we got. The dynamic duos, Scott Will and Winning Tips are right here on NBA 2K TV. So if you guys would like to take a look at this one, you could do it right from here. And remember, there's definitely more coming episodes right from here. And next season will be NBA 2K21. Don't be mind about my question, because that's my uh, only choice, but I have to do. Anyways, let's get right into the Fiserv.forum and see what we have here. This is game two of Bucks against the Raptors. Welcome to the weekend, everybody. Let's get it going with NBA action on 2K Sports. Kevin Harlan here, joined by our analyst Greg Anthony and Hall of Famer Doris Burke. Plus, reporting for the sidelines, another Hall of Famer, David Aldridge. There might be two already, but I can't figure it out which one it is. Let's hear what David is. Well, for the Milwaukee Bucks, it had been an 18-year dry spell. They hadn't won a playoff series since 2001, the longest such drought in the league. But with superstar Giannis Antetokounmpo leading the way, the times are indeed changing in Bruce City. Kevin? Pascal giving him another try to see what he could do. But Pascal, uh, Pascal Siakam is the only man that was the Jordan player of the game in game one, round two. Let's find out the lineup songs. And right now, the uh, key matchup, Siakam and Ashtakupo, are still ready to get things on the target. As I'm noticing uh, which. Uh, which player can handle the best, they might do it again. Here's the tip-off. Here we go. Let's see who wins. Milwaukee Bucks wins the tip-off, and game two starts now. Anji Kupo, here's Blatso, covered by Lowry. Free for Middleton. Wide open look, assist by Middleton of Bledsoe. Bledsoe has his first assist. What a great shot for Middleton that was putting out the baseline on the wing. Now, here are the commentators from here, Ray Anthony Doris Berg and Kevin Harlan. Ziako with a lazy two and a push of a round and, and right in the paint. That was the first bucket in game two. Here's Achitokounmpo. He only has his time uh, to, uh, to find his way before he can reach up to his next uh, game at Toronto. Lopez rolling around to Bledsoe over Lowry. A two is off the mark. Ibaka takes his first rebound. Last outing for Toronto, they won that game against Utah. Yes, we did know that one, that they played against Utah. A long time that they did. Drilling up is Lowry, missing the three. Ashtakupo looking out for another ball movement. Lopez, pass to, Lope, to Bledsoe. Here's a drive, and there's a two conversion for Bledsoe. That's two points for uh, Eric Bledsoe, and now here's Lowry. He only missed the three-point shot opportunity, but didn't uh, save his rebounding time. Lowry finds Ibaka, covered by Lopez, Brooke Lopez. Lowry back up uh, the other way. The shot, Lowry drills it in from two as this one comes in by one. They're taking it too much money to go from inside and outside. Anshtakupo pass to Lopez. Lopez to Bledsoe, back to Brooke Lopez. Brooke Lopez to Wesley Matthews or Van Vliet. And there we have the two. Matthews delivers the uh, shot from the paint. 
And they are leading by three. Last time they met was in Toronto. Yeah, and they got beat last time these two. Yeah, this is what happens in game one. Unfortunately for uh, Giants at Chikubo, they, their team can never win it because they just didn't get there at, at that all time. Look at this on Chikubo. What a dunk. How do you how do you feel whenever players get a dunk? They feel like they want to. So so I'm gonna say it again as uh, as the Bucks never got a chance to win against uh, against the Raptors in Game One. That's because the early start was being pulled out by uh, Kyle Lowry, uh, Pascal Siakam, Serge Ibaka, Fred Van Vliet, and Adanobi. Probably another shot to take here. I don't know if it is the right time, but I don't think there might not be another chance to go for another win if they keep it going. That's because last time they, they won against the Bucks in, uh, in the Eastern Conference Championship game. But uh, but uh, likely the uh, unlikely the uh, Bucks, they are not able to uh, pick up the pace more to reach the finals. Wesley Matthews delivers a number two, but leads him up by four points for Matthews. Raptors trailing, Raptors trailing by seven, 345, as there are tough defense by the Raptors going really hard against the Bucks and on offense. Now here's Van Vliet, he passed incomplete, Alex Jacupo takes the ball. And it's ripped away by Ananobi. The first turnover comes up by Toronto Raptors. We have a foul on Alex Jacupo, his first. He went down on the floor really hard, did find a great pass about uh, about Ananobi, trying to keep his uh, shot in momentum, looking for some passes. They're going really long at that time. Pascal going for speed, and this one was dropping out of the point, out of the line. And at the free throw, he'll shoot two. How amazing is he? First draft, first got draft in the first round since 2016. With uh, Ben Simmons. Two shots. Shooting two is Pascal Siakam. Substitutions are making some changes after the first shot. Siakam hits the first one down. Wesley Matthews is checked out and DiVincento is back in. Just right down for 322 on the clock. I don't know why Why does it come out so quick. But I don't know if it might be happening again. Siakam taking one shot. He delivers a two and they're, and they're trailing by five. The players have taken their game to another level. A lot of improvement they've done individually. Ashikufo only got two points. He passes to Di Vincenzo. Maybe the greatest single individual leap I've ever seen is by the reigning most of the time. Fine over Siakam. There's four points. This by Di Vincenzo. And then became such an integral part of an NBA championship team. Kemba Walker, who is an all-star caliber player, all-NBA level guy, continues to stay in the lab and keep improving. So, a ton of guys, Demonte Simonis, another young big has been incredible. Uh, just great to see guys progress. Siaka missed the number two pointer as Burke Lopez grabs his first rebound. Burke Lopez looking around on the floor, trying to make some open offense. Overpass by Middleton. Back to Lopez. Back to Lopez. Good, and he delivers the first first assist for Middleton. Timeout called by Toronto. Their first timeout in the first quarter by 2:28 remaining. What a nice uh, what a nice play they did as the Raptors did take their did take their win in the first game against the Bucks. Noticing how I'm, how my difference is, is becoming in the in between. Uh, one more look here as I go over flashback. Let me tell you what the flashback is. The Bucks win two games in, their, in 2019 season that time after they played against the Raptors. And then in the third game, it was the Raptors on the series with one. And then game four, they are coming back into its pace in game in game four. Then game three, it was not enough to keep the, the momentum going for the Bucks. 
So the Raptors win in Game 5, and then Game 6, they finished it all with 4-2. to two, And that's how you know what the game will look like. That's all we need to know what the Raptors did back in their last season. And now here are some changes for uh, for Toronto. Hollis Jefferson has checked in. Powell, Boucher, Gasol, and, and Powell. Passes to Boucher. Passes to Powell. Screen on Ed Davis. Powell with a step back in. One. There's That's one for one. This is Powell at his best. In attack mode, he is hard to stop. Bucks leading by seven. Bucks lead by seven. Just two minutes to play here in the first quarter. Back pass to George Hill. Guy Connaughton on the left. Here's a shot. The two pointers in for Connaughton. That's his first bucket of the night. Just one for you to go. As the as the Bucks lead by nine. There's a minute thirty. Davis passes to Hollis Jefferson. Here's Hollis Jefferson. Now he dishes to Gasol. Around Lopez. Reconnected. And there's a putback for Gasol. That's the first two for the night. One thing we know is he will win. One fifteen left. George Hill looking around the man. Going from offense, Hill passes to DiVincenzo. Connaughton right on the wing with the drive. And that's uh, Toronto with another rebound. Powell, that's to Hollis Jefferson. Hollis Jefferson, small move up in the forward position. He's really skilled after he played last season with the Brooklyn Nets. Now here's Lopez. Robin Lopez, I meant to Here's say. Connaughton, this is a three. And again, Connaughton delivers the first three of the game. Connaughton has got five points right right from the start. After he played in college, and after he played Notre Dame in college basketball, after he finished his career by his senior year. It was a celebration for all the senior, senior day and night. But we're really excited to show what is happening in between for our Pat Connaughton's memories that Kubla leaves in. Powell against Steven Chenzo, running out of time. Powell didn't make that shot clock, and that one came off loose. Pass it to Robin Lopez. Robin Lopez to Hill, five seconds to go. Here's a shot for DiVincenzo. The buzz meter's good. Drains it in for two, and that's two points for DiVincenzo. What a shot it's made. Second quarter's on its way next. Be back after this. That's something I relish. It's something unique. It's something to take pride in that uh, you have all your teammates back on the defensive end, you know, um, and when it gets down to it, you're kind of that last line of defense. And obviously, defense is a team-oriented ideal, but there's something fun about that. I think there's something competitive about that. Robin Lopez keeping his deep in momentum, trying to make sure he gets there quite time before he before he reaches out without calling the foul on Robin Lopez. So second quarter has started right now as Ed Davis passes to Gasol. Ilya Sofa trying to keep it covered. Gasol adds two points, and that's four for Gasol. Now here's Gil. Never got a chance to make the point here, but only three had made back in the first game. Corfa, Connaughton rolling over to Williams. Connaughton for three. Hey, slams it in as the assist comes up by Williams. Connaughton's got eight points. Only difference between Middleton and Connaughton. There might be enough chance to look for. I don't know if there is. And Davis with the wide open look is off the mark. Just played one minute left. One minute on the round. Screen on Williams. The fadeaway shot's good. Ten points for Connaughton. 
and it's Davis, and it's Davis with the ball after he missed a three pointer since the start comes up by the second quarter. Davis coming around the court trying to look for open offense. There's a screen on Hollis Jefferson. His shots counts in. That's four points for Hollis Jefferson. That's his second bucket of the game. 520 left. Here's Gill. He bounce passes to Williams. Gasol on the cover, looking for somebody to open. Over to Corver. Connaughton again. Rebounded by Elias Sofa. And a putback is good for Elias Sofa. Boucher has his first. Only one free throw for, for the Milwaukee and one free throw for Toronto Raptors. Elias Sofa will go to the line to shoot one. Even with this lead, I Only the guy I used to mention, uh, uh, Eli Sofa, has done amazing to get there. After a substitution, Eli Sofa will take one free throw at the line for one shot. Eli Sofa missed one. They, they didn't get there as a free throw as 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 that before happened. Ibaka outside, pass back to Lowry. Now he passes to Ananobi. 450 left. Ibaka shot. It's off the mark. Eli Sofa grabs a rebound. Bucks leading by 13. Eli Sofa now dishes off to Corfer. Corfer around. Ooh, wow, what a shot for Corfer makes. And there's the foul called on Siaka. That's his first foul for uh, for Siaka. And his second team foul for Toronto. Here, a different look for the Milwaukee. And Takumbo subbed in for Marvin Williams. Corfer will go to the line to shoot one. Brooke Lopez, Wesley Matthews, Middleton, and Bluts. Might be Bledsoe. Corver hits a free throw. Yep, and that is Bledsoe. Who may be named the coach of the year? Just four for three left. We're finding out which coach of the year has done the best. Well, obviously, you think about who has the best record. That's the first thing you look at. And what has contributed to that best record? But it isn't only about that, right? You have to consider, number one, what's the roster challenges that head coach may have had to overcome? What a block by Brooke Lopez, and that's the first first rejection on defense he made. Making up a great year as a basketball coach in the NBA. So many things. All right, let's catch up with our Let's catch up on the sideline for David Aldrich. Well, Kevin, Kyle Lowry is hard-nosed, as we all know, and if you ask him, it comes from his upbringing in Philadelphia. Lowry said, a Philly player is what a basketball player is. We played on concrete. you got to be mentally tough. You're not trying to be athletic. You get hit the wrong way, you run into a metal pole. Kevin, that's what made him from Philly to Villanova to Toronto to an NBA champion. With a shot for Bledsoe, it's off the mark. Tough contested by each team. David, thank you. And here are the Raptors now, following the miss by Eric Bledsoe. The shot's good. What an excellent post-entry pass. Good things happen when you make that next look. Bucks leading by 14. Now on to Kumbo to Corfer. After the shot by Ibaka. Bledsoe passing around to Blue Lopez. Brooke Lopez. Over Ibaka. Milwaukee can't lead another shot. And this it is off the mark. Van Vliet checking in for an, a one of each player at a time. Van Vliet searching around the floor. Lowry with the three. That is a miss by Lowry with the second chance of three. Here's Antikupo. Wow, what a dunk this is. Giannis puts it down hard. Just like the same, uh, same screen that was happening in the play. That was happening a lot. Guys, Lowry against Bledsoe, just 2.22 remaining. Taking the lid off. 
want the pass by Lopez, but recovered by Abaca. Abaca coming into the paint. Lopez. And it's Brooke Lopez sends it back. Three seconds to shoot. Got to make it cover. Abaca will take a number two as the assist comes out by Van Vliet. That will be, be Van Vliet's first assist of the game. Corver rolling out to Brooke Lopez under two minutes. Wesley Matthews. Good. Makes one in. A tough contest shot. The journey of the Raptors' Nick Nurse, so well traveled before taking the head job in Toronto. This guy has shown his worth in his first season as a head coach in the NBA. It translates to a title. Absolutely incredible. Thank you, Doris Burke. And now heading back on the court is Lowry against Bledsoe. Pass to Anunoby. Van Vliet. Five seconds to shoot. Needs to make some shot quick. Lowry went missing. A fighting rebound by Siakam, and it's sent back by the Greek freak. Giannis puts up a first block of the night. Corver rolling over to Bledsoe. Bledsoe passes to Matthews. Brooke Lopez right coming in behind a three-point line. The foul is on Ibaka, his first, and that'll be their fourth team foul for Toronto. Well, Brooke Lopez, such a versatile scorer. Such a nice uh, guy for uh, Brooke Lopez. He's trying to skip his effort before he, before he wants to get back in. Brooke Lopez looking in for something big uh, that happens. I'm seeing what, what everybody is doing about his shot. Mike Bolehos would have the offense to try to uh, move it around more. Don't just let them stand here. And now Brooke Lopez will shoot for two. And the first one. Lopez grabs the first one. Here are some substitutions for Toronto. Ibaka, Ananobi, and Van Lee are checked out. Davis, Hoss, Jefferson, Powell, and Gasol are checked in. All five players are coming out, but Brooke Lopez has switched off into point forward after uh, after Robin Lopez is checked in. Norman Bowles checked in for Fred Van Vliet. Davis is subbed in for Kyle Lowry. Lopez will hit two free throws. It's got four points. Fifty seconds to go in the second in the second period for the first half. Siakam against Lopez. Great Steve, and there's a foul on Hill, and the shot counts for Siakam. This guy is such a good rebounder. His length, his athletic. Well, there was a great D for Brooke Lopez, but there is a putback. And there is a foul on George Hill. In their last Brooke Lopez is checked out, and Marvin Williams is checked back in. Milwaukee making a switch here. Williams is checked in. And now one shot will go for is Siakam. I don't hear you banging out there, fans. See, he makes one, and that's how you know you would have made it distracted. But he's still focused. So that's his first personal foul for George Hill, and now he passes it off to Vincenzo. About 30 seconds to play in the first half. Williams covered by Siakam. Rolls over to Robin Lopez. Over Gasol. And Lopez will grab some two in the point. That's his first buck basket for Robin Lopez since uh, Brooke Lopez is scoring a big time. Davis, back pass. Here's Davis. The fadeaway jumper is good. He knew what he would happen. He tried to get one, and there it is. Five seconds left. Lopez outside. And we'll leave it off from here. That's the end of the first half, and it's closed. 40 to 25 is their score. Siakam making some ball movement here, but Giannis had a lot more better to get there about the time. Now let's send it over to David Aldridge on the sideline. David. Kevin, thanks. Coach, you guys have been able to limit their score, and how have you done that? I think our activity up in the pick and rolls is making it uh, difficult on them, contesting every shot, uh, denying just our activity in general. High hands and quick feet. Thanks, Coach. Back to you, Kevin. 
Thanks, David. We'll be back, we'll be back I think, for the, for the uh, second half of the third period after this. We are ready to start the second half as uh, as we are taking a look about Pat Connaughton's uh, score. He was definitely been drafted since 2015 of uh, the season with uh, Jerry and Grant. And by that game, you guys would know what uh, what Pat Connaughton's up to on his way to his journey. After uh, you guys have, if you guys are taking a look for our Hoops Nation, you then you should check out what what the um, on Optum is on Showtime. Yeah, it's it's also available on each cable so that you like to uh, watch something on demand. But make sure you uh, make sure if you don't have Showtime, you can upgrade it on any any system you like to use. Be, make sure you ask your parents for permission. Here's Antetokounmpo, Wesley Matthews, the Spurries at three, and there's assist by Antetokounmpo. Nice catch uh, with the shot, great pass, rip. And then the shot, however, he, made, he manages to make the three. And the shooting guard. Van Vliet against Matthews. Who has no hesitation. Lowry taking the step from Berber. And Achtakumbo has sent another rebound and another miss by Lowry. Just one, uh, just one of each substitution that might need to do. Here's Lopez, and that's good. Another shot for uh, Lopez as he's got six. Siakam against Anshikumbo. That was Anshikumbo and not even what Robin Lopez was thinking of contested, tough contested shot. Matthews scanning the floor. He passes to Bledsoe. Five to shoot. Five to shoot. Looking for another open shot. Lopez with the shot. Good. That's for Ibaka. That's eight points for Lopez. Brooke Lopez. Wow, what a start. Three for three. Terrific play calling. Everything clicking out of the gates here. Just under five minutes left. Here's Ananobi. We covered it up. The shot's off the mark as Ananobi couldn't, couldn't save it. That's six rebounds for Anjakumpo as he only has five points. Bledsoe outside, covered by Alawi. Bounce pass to Brooke Lopez. Anjakumpo on the roll, and there's a shot for Anjakumpo. That's seven points in the game, assist by Brooke Lopez. Siakam was rolling out the floor. Achikupo avoided the screen on Baca. The last touch is on Van Vliet, and that's Bucks ball. Here's a look at Norman Powell one more time. You guys are already experiencing right now. But I don't think there might not be any season for Norman Powell if he gets back in. A different score than earlier in the 4.15 left, Antetokounmpo still hasn't recovered to take the lead possession. Now here's Giannis. Giannis passed the Bledsoe. Over Lowry. The layup drive for Bledsoe is no good. First miss of the second half. They've come out here. Only two points for Bledsoe and didn't save enough uh, shots for uh, as he missed four of them. The three, it's a bucket outside and Lowry's back in. He's trying too many threes on outside, but there's a shot that you would know. Anjakumbo kicks, kicks to Middleton. Middleton to Lopez. Lopez up. Fine, rolling in. The Rolling into that, and Brooke Lopez will grab a number two. Graduated as your college's all-time assistant. Timeout, Toronto. That'll be that'll be um, uh, their second timeout for Toronto in the second half. Three twenty-one remaining, fifty-one to thirty. Looking really well on each team for for the Bucks. What a moment this is! It's happening. But the Greek Freak will never see see that one again until it comes to another season. Here's some changes for Milwaukee Bucks and Toronto. 
Carver comes in for Chris Middleton. Carver comes in for Chris Middleton. Then it's Robin Lopez comes in for Brooke Lopez. And it's Connaughton subbing in by Middleton. The shot for Boucher it says pull it up two points. That's his first bucket for tonight, and Atsukupo pulling out something big happening. Atsukupo passes to Middleton. Connaughton for the three. The drive for free for Connaughton. That's his total that comes up. That's 13 points for Connaughton. Assist by uh, Bledsoe. Toronto has possession. Over one of each player is missing out one of each shots in every angle or, or wing or corner or in a paint. That would not matter. Powell almost lost it, but covered it. There's Boucher with the second bucket. There is an imagination. Assist by uh, Powell. Two thirty on the board. The and let's catch up with our. Let's catch up on the sideline, David Aldridge. Well, Kevin, after five years as an assistant in Toronto last season, Nick Nurse moved to head coach of the Raptors, and the team responded, winning the franchise's first NBA championship. Nurse has been at this for three decades. He got his first head coaching position at the age of 23. He has moved all throughout basketball, both domestically and abroad, guiding 15 teams in five different countries. After winning it all last year, Kevin, he's finally made it to the top. David, thank you so, so much for your time and see what is happening. After some substitutions in, following up by by Kyle Corfer with the two assists by Bledsoe. Gasol looking out and a rejection by, uh, after substitution, Outside it was a rejection by Robin Lopez. Gasol, Gasol right away. Antetokounmpo grabs his seventh rebound. Rebound number seven for him tonight. Antetokounmpo rolling it over to Bledsoe. Bledsoe left side. Trying to find his way, giving it up. Just five on the clock. And Connaughton has it in the corner. Connaughton over Davis. And there's a two for Connaughton, and that grabs the 15 points assist by Bledsoe. Outstanding game for uh, for all the players from the Bucks. They're going out way better than they had. Davis against Connaughton. What a quick pass by Davis, and, a, and there's a shot by Hollis Jefferson. Timeout will call by Bucks. Their first time out in the first half. And now they're going over for a different look on defense and offense. Two new players are coming in back on the court as George Kill comes in for Bledsoe and Ely Sofa comes in for Antetokounmpo. 116 to go as Hill only has nothing left to go for momentum. He didn't look at his first bucket, but his shot went off. Davis on the wing, Powell on the wing. The shot's off. Connaughton grabs his first rebound. Here's Connaughton. Needs some post up already. Passes it to Lee Sofa. Rolling into Lopez. Robin Lopez, the number two. And there's a shot. One of each shots, as there's a second bucket for Robin Lopez, assisted by Ely Sofa. 41 seconds. 40 seconds to play here, the third quarter. Alice Jefferson out in the wing. Connaughton grabbing him on the D. Davis outside. Passes over to Powell. Rolling some changes. The foul's on Robin Lopez. Two shots are coming up for Powell, Norman Powell. A lot of defending, but there's a tough call here for Robin Lopez. He's trying to knock it out of the way. And there he went. He went on the floor, rolling himself over. Didn't stop him already. It went, it went too much. Now two shots will be Norman Powell.
Norman you know, Powell misses his first. Well, one thing there's no question about and is that Siakam's checked back in for Boucher. Now it's Only two points for Boucher. He never had a chance to uh, try to go for the putback. Well, making a switch here. Twenty-two point nine seconds. Norman Powell will take one shot. Good on the second. Good on the second. And Milwaukee has possession. Milwaukee still has possession. George Hill missing out on one of each games. Never got a chance to get some points back in. Receiving the screens. Ida Sofa helps him out. George Hill got his first basket of the night. Well, you love to watch George Hill stroke it from the mid range, demonstrates his ability to score from just about anywhere. Here's a shot for Gasol. Oh, almost made a buzz beater. Gasol had it in. There he went. He went back in, and that's how I did notice. Well, that was a perfect uh, timing for uh, for Mark Gasol as we end the third quarter. Only couple team momentum. Looking out for no suggestions at all. The scoring is 62 to 40. We'll be back with the fourth quarter after this. Stay tuned and we'll be right with you with the Jordan player to game. Here's the State Farm assist of the game. And one team that you're never going to look out is Wesley Matthews. He only has couple. He only has made a couple shots earlier. Only uh, given up for uh, one shot, and he made the count the bus basket in after P after Pascal Siaka make his first foul. With all things that happened to that man, Wesley Matthews. He turned out to be a slight, a slight shot and pulled it back in. That's George Hill and his Divincenzo pass over to Williams. That's the five on the floor for the Bucks. Williams, Williams rolling around to Divincenzo. Here's Divincenzo. Screen on Divincenzo. I mean Eliasova. The floater up in the air, and that's good for Divincenzo. The bigger defender. There are a lot of challenges going up from from Siakam and Norman Powell. Others may be a little bit off the ring, not challenging their enough strategy, but they need to put it back where they were. And Davis missing out. One of each shot opens. Divincenzo, what a shot for uh, Divincenzo on the outside range. That is seven points for Divincenzo, assisted by Ili Sofa. Well, there's probably good offense and good defense. Everybody's looking around to find things happen. A lot of advantage, pulling out right in, in and out. It's all against Ili Sofa. It's all with the layup. He covered it back, and there's a two. It's all has been putting up back in the points when uh, when his shot came out early with another rebound. Think about the Houston Rockets in each of the last two years. The Rockets here. have actually taken more threes than twos. This is the evolution of the game. Milton going over Hollis Jefferson. Milton's got a two points. Point opportunities at the rim and three point shots. And Brown the dribbling motion, Ron the crossover, and there's your shot. Middleton's got five. Over a minute and a half played here in the fourth. We're just down to 520 left on the board. Pass to Gasol. Pass to Gasol. Over Ailey Sofa, the layup for Gasol has put itself in. That's five assists for uh, Hollis, I mean, Boucher, Norman Powell. I think it might be Hollis Jefferson. I think it's that Davis. I don't, yeah, that might be Davis. 11 points for uh, Gasol. Williams coming around. Counts the bucket in, and that's his first point of the night. Overall, I'm checking out what Marvin Williams is going through. You know what he needs to go on? He has to get, he has to find his uh, find his teammate and give himself the, with an open chance look. 
uphill against Davis. What happens if they don't uh, if they don't look open enough? And I'll be off. Siakam with the amazing touch that has nine points over Antetokounmpo's point. Trailed up by one. One point. Davis. Hill, back pass to DiVincenzo. Outside, Outside is Williams. Shot clock to four. And Hill sends the fade away in, and that's his second bucket of the night. Four points for Hill. Davis around the other way with his possession. Siakam outside. Powell shooting a three. A shot by Powell, shot by Powell. By Powell is no good. Performance on the interior. The rebounding has been only 13 rebounds for Toronto, but with Milwaukee, they're signing out 19 rebounds. Really tough luck already. Tough look already, but maybe there might be more time. Hill to Williams. The, the elbow. Yeah, number two for Gordon Williams. That's four points in fourth quarter. 3.15 left. Three on Hollis Jefferson. Davis coming in the paint with a shot. And there it is. Fluid tap downtown by Ed Davis. Picking up his uh, another range. And now for the Bucks, they're outscoring for uh, by the Raptors by 15. Across the game the right region. now, they are trailing up. I also believe that young men who have talent should be able They're trailing to up by 37. I don't think that's not the right one. So, listen, I'm sure Maybe I must have miscalculated wrong. After a missed shot by, uh, I, I don't know who it was, was but I just have no in clue. The league, and that's certainly going to happen whenever it happens. Siakam. And we got a foul and a dunk by Siakam. DiVincenzo sends his first personal foul. He went right over around him, not even seeing what they're believing in. Sterling Brown comes in for Chris Middleton. And it's Here are some new changes. McCaw, Thomas, Siakam in the small four, and Johnson. Thomas comes in for Norman. One shot for Siakam. Brown, Horford, and. Lopez, they're checked in. Siakam hits the first one down with his one free throw. And so he'll bring it up for the Milwaukee Bucks. He'll bring it up for the Milwaukee Bucks. The Bucks lead by lead by uh, by 24. Kicks it to Lopez. Kicks it to Robin Lopez. Six. Robin Lopez with a shot. Basket good. That's basket good for Robin Lopez. Mr. Lopez, I see you. Uh, Mr. Lopez, I think you're so smart. I think you got more. And the Raptors. Two minutes left in the fourth quarter. Here's McCaw against Phil. There's 154 left to play. 150 left. Siakam coming in the paint. Siakam against Williams. And, and there we have a loose ball foul on Johnson. That's that'll be his first personal foul. Jefferson's checked in. And Hollis Jefferson is checked back in for Siakam. Just 144 left. Milwaukee's got another hole from three point line. Another hole from the three point line for by each player. Hill gets this off to Brown. Brown, and there's his first bucket for Brown. Mr. Brown with a first shot in the fourth quarter, looking out something big happening. A dominating performance. McCaw dishes off to Gasol. Around over to Wallace Jefferson. This is a quality win across the board. Thomas outside. Gasol with the screen. Here's his shot for Thomas. No shot from the three point line that went off wide. One minute left to go. 
And Milwaukee Bucks will take the tie with one to one. Corver past the Lopez. Well, I think he made his presence felt in the paint more than anywhere else. This guy's Here's Brown. A second bucket has drawn in. That's four points for Brown. Put this game on ice. That might be a, that might be way tough with the shot, but I'm just like nothing what concerns me about Robin Lopez. And when you turn around, you see what Brown is up to. I guess that might be the only person that wants to give him a shot since he never played it in the last three quarters. And watch Brown one more time from the, from the corner. And then when Brown is and then when Brown comes in, there you see as the pass was up by Robin Lopez, grabbing himself a number two. What a shot for Brown. Now now we'll put it back in. Here's McCall. Now here's McCall. 40 seconds left. Hill trying to cover him up on McCall. Pass to Gasol. Rebounded by Corfer. So Second the rebound for uh, Kyle Corfer. 23 seconds left in the game. 20 seconds of the game. Yeah, George three. Hill outside. Just trying to shoot. We'll keep it from here since the shot clock has come to a violation. That'll be Toronto ball. And now with only one, now one, now here's the last change for Milwaukee. George Hill is checked out, Connaughton is checked back in. Milwaukee ties it up, the series one to one, 81 to 51. That is your final score of the game in game two. They are really putting it back a lot since the Raptors came out in an early lead and with the start of the first game. They were not but for the Bucks, they did come back in. Pat Connaughton did have a shot. Now let's send it over to David Aldridge for the post game. Thanks, Kevin. Here with Eric Bledsoe. Eric, a strong performance tonight. What's been the difference? Uh, we're getting out of transition, you know, trying to get people to stop. And everybody's just playing their game. And it's show tonight, Eric. Thanks very much. Back to you, Kevin. Thank you so much, David. Thank you guys so much for watching for this video. If you'd like to see some more, don't forget you can subscribe to my channel. Find something up. Find the NBA playlist on my channel of the NBA seasons of the regular game that you can check it out that I did post. Or you can follow me on my social media because I will be doing some more social medias pretty soon. And with that, here's your Jordan player of the game. This one's out by Pat Connaughton with just 15 points, one rebound, and just eight minutes on the court. You know what Pat Connaughton has done? He's done a lot of shooting he can, he can protect. And score another points in position to help Antetokounmpo get back in. But anyway, that should include game two, and then game three as the Bucks are heading at, they'll be traveling to Toronto, to face against the Raptors in Game 3 at Scotia Bank Arena. And, that, and then uh, we'll see what happens. What will come with the Bucks if they can still manage to win again. And anyways, thanks for watching. As until next time, peace out, bitches, for as a while as a NBA playoff dial. So long, everyone.